In this tutorial we're gonna look at how to sort by date in Microsoft Excel. I have some mock data right here. This is generated with help from mockaroo.com. I have a first name, a last name and an email address and over here I have a sign out date and we're going to use this column to demonstrate how to sort by date in Microsoft Excel. First thing that you have to do is making sure that your data has the correct format. Meaning that you need to make sure that your dates are actually stored in date format because if we look over here on a random date like this one over here and we look at the in the home tab on the number group we see that the format is general for this one for others it is the date format so this means that my format is not correct for the whole column and I will not be able to sort if it remains uh, this way so let's see what we can do to change this now the first thing that uh, that you can do you can select the column and everything uh, within it you can go to home number and from here you can select short date and that will convert your values to a date format or we can use the format painter if you want to learn more about it i have a video about format painter you can look it up in the description so to do this we we're going to select a, a cell that has a correct uh, data format we're going to click on format painter and then we're going to click over here where it says uh, where is this, this d and if you click on it we're going to apply the date style to the whole column and now if we look over the values everything is stored as a date, which is exactly what we need. Now to move to sorting, we're gonna first select the column that we want to sort on, which is the sign out date. And then we're gonna go over here to the editing group to sort and filter. And we have these options right here, A to Z, Z to A and custom sort. We can use these, but these are actually pretty confusing because we're trying to sort from the biggest value to the smallest value or in reverse order. And over here we have A to Z and Z to A, but we just have to understand that Z to A it's actually descending to ascending and A to Z ascending to descending. So I'm just going to select Z to A and now I will have this uh, warning pop up saying that uh, I didn't select uh, my whole range of cells where I have data and I need to either expand the selection or continue with the current selection. I'm just going to expand it because if you continue with the current selection we're going to sort only on column D but we want our whole data to be sorted and so I'm going to select this option and I'm going to click sort and just like that the days that are on top are the closest to the current uh, current time I have here the 30th of uh, September and the oldest dates 1st of January 9th of January and so on now that we saw the easiest thing that we could do to sort by date, let's see some alternative ways to do this and we'll start with the first one which is to select all of our data and click Ctrl, Shift and L and with that Excel will show us this, uh, these drop downs from here that we, we could use. So if we click on the button from column D, you see that we have the same options that we had over here. So let's sort A to Z and just like that uh, the newest dates are on top. And another thing that we could do is to continue to select all of our data and go over here to the data tab and from here click on sort and over here we could use a bunch of options we can select the column that we want to sort I'm gonna leave uh, as a uh, sign out date and select if we want to sort on the font color cell cell icon cell color so we have a bunch of options if we need to use them and uh, then we can select the order I'm just going to select A to Z and keep in mind that this is very important over here my data has headers obviously we have headers first name last name email and sign out date if we didn't have then this should be unchecked but for me, for my data, I'm gonna leave it as checked. And if we click OK, our data has been sorted. This is how we sort in Microsoft Excel. If you have any type of questions, please leave them in the comments. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and share with someone that's interested in Microsoft Excel. Thank you for watching.